All right, you guys, here we go. We are at the top of the hour. We're going to go ahead and get started. We're going to go ahead and get started. All right. Thank you guys so very much for coming to our Get Fit Mining Global presentation. My name is your Queen Connectress, Miss Marnita Casa, and I will be your humble hostess for today. Now, it is my honor to introduce you all to a man that for over 25 years dominated the direct sales industry. His cryptocurrency education is being used by companies and universities worldwide. For over six years, he dedicated his life to learning about cryptocurrency and blockchain technology, but he didn't just stop there. He decided to go out and share his information with the masses, and he did this by putting on fun and exciting Bitcoin boot camps nationwide at no cost. He has built thriving communities and wonderful platforms like you see before you now. So without further ado, it is my honor to introduce you all to Mr. Brandon I. All right, all right. Thank you for that introduction, Miss Casa, and happy Saturday. Good morning, everybody, or afternoon or evening, depending on where you're logging in from. It's early Saturday morning for me, 9 o'clock a.m. here in Los Angeles. As Miss Casa said, I got to give it back to her. She has been doing double duty this past week, not only being our hostess, but also doing the presentation. She did three presentations this week, and she stepped up, and we said, where are the women at? She said, here. <laughs> so she did her presentation. She did one yesterday. You'll see her again next week. And we are looking for more people who want to do presentations. So just let me know. So welcome, 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 everybody. It's an exciting time to be here. More than 60 days of the Avalanche launch into this project. But that's not, we've been here for almost six months. And so I'm going to do something a little bit different today since it is Saturday. And I'm going to give you guys a little bit of background on how we got here, how we got to this point. Uh, moving forward, I know that Lynette was going to be doing a presentation at at two uh, one p.m. Eastern, right at this time. She's got to move that back to to Monday. Uh, so I'm doing this presentation, and I'm also going to do a special reading of the Move Quest ecosystem tonight at nine p.m. Eastern, six p.m. Pacific, on the same Zoom link. So, but let's some of you don't know, you know, how do we get here? You might be brand new on the Avalanche side. But we actually came on this project back in March, earlier this year. I first heard about it in February. And I own my own crypto education company called Ivy League Crypto Academy or ILCA. And we've got a pretty good size community. And we were looking for something this year in 2024 to get involved with. There's one thing that I teach crypto education, but it's another when people want to make money. So I was trying to find something viable that our community can get involved in, that they can exercise the knowledge that they've been learning, put it into practice, and actually make money in some good crypto projects. Unfortunately, the last three, four, five, well, three years, four years, you know, project after project in the crypto space, uh, they may start off sounding good. They may have good intentions, great ideas, but they ultimately end up failing from one reason to another through to, due to circumstances outside of our control. And it's not that uh, we hope that everything can make it, but even in business, 90% of businesses fail. And when you add crypto onto that, it's even higher. But a worst case scenario is when you've got people that get involved in these crypto opportunities and they end up having a rug pull. They end up getting scammed. They end up losing all of their funds. Uh, you know, get jaded in this industry. And that doesn't take away from the crypto space because there's bad actors in the space. This is still brand new. Even when the internet came about, there were many companies in those early 90s, uh, at the end of the 90s, so the early 2000s, that were scamming people, scamming companies, taking people's money in the early wild, wild west days of, of the internet. And that's we're still in that process now with crypto. So I wanted to find, is there an opportunity, not that everybody can get rich in, but can we find an opportunity to allow people to earn just a little bit of money and then use that money and their crypto knowledge to build a diversified portfolio and grow from there with some extra cash? That's all I was looking at that has the lowest amount of risk possible. 
That's what we were looking for, not get rich quick. I avoided all of the, the I don't want to call these scam companies, but the opportunities that say, you know, get started with us. And we guarantee you 3% a day, 3% a week, 10% a month. All you have to do is give us your money and we're going to double it for you. We're going to compound. You're going to make returns every single month. You don't have to do nothing, but you go ahead and recruit and, and you lock your money's locked up for six months. And people get addicted to those things. Why? Because in the early beginnings, people do make a lot of money until you don't, until a rug pull happens and people run off to Panama with everybody's money and they go into hiding. So I wanted, I wanted to stay away from those projects and find projects that actually had real world value to it, meaning the product itself is what is making you money, not going out there to recruit. That's what we were looking for. So when I heard about Get Fit Mining, the concept of being able to earn on your own physical activity, that intrigued my interest, that piqued my interest. When I heard that if this thing works, we can have the average person earning anywhere between $500 to $1,500 a month, that really piqued my interest. We're not talking about enough money to walk off your job. But I'm like, you mean to tell me people can make $500 to $1,500 a month without having to recruit, without having to sell a physical product, an item? Tell me more. So when my sponsor, Peter Blackwell, was telling me about this, I said, I need to interview the people behind this. See, one thing that I've learned is I never want to be in a position where I see something that I like. And then I bring it to the community by saying, I vetted this. I like it. Signed up just because I say so. This is going to be the next big thing. I don't operate that way with our community. Instead, I say, I'm going to interview you and your team in front of our community because our community is also crypto educated and our community can make their own informed, intelligent decision, not based on what I say. What's good for me that may not be good for you. So I want to put them in front of all of you. And I interviewed Lynette and her team at the end of March just to see what the community had to say about her and what they saw. You guys may see things that I don't. You may catch red flags that I don't. And then as a collective unit, we discuss it and say, is this something that we want to do? And at, after the end of that interview, I was really impressed with it. But I had a timeline on when I wanted to move forward. Uh, because I was also in the process of relaunching my own company. And I was looking at sometime in April. It was members in the community who came to me and said, nah, Brent, nah, B, we need to get in this now. <laughs> like, like Brother Herschel Pro, we need to get in now. Let's run with this thing. And we did. And we got started. And we were excited. It was on the Binance Smart Chain. The value of the token at the time was less than 0 0.002 cents. Within less than 30 days from our community coming on board and getting exciting and running this thing, we pushed the token value up more than a penny. We're talking about the GFAM token on the Binance side. We had a lot of testimonials. In fact, Rita Bruchard is one of them. I like to highlight her because when she got started, she used a testimonial after five weeks of just doing her own physical activity. Five weeks, she had made $172. And we just thought about that. Can you imagine earning this extra money just on your own physical activity? That was, that was insane. I mean, we heard of others step into Sweatcoin. But after two years on Sweatcoin, I only made 20 bucks and I walked more than three, mi three million miles. <laughs> $20. So we were excited about that. And the reason why is because we know what to do with the money. I even teach if you, uh, another day. I'll tell you my story. When I got into the crypto space, I turned $30 into six figures in just a couple of months. So if you have the knowledge, you know what to do. So we were excited about that. However, what we did not, what we were not prepared for was that GetFit wasn't brand new. This, this was an opportunity that's been out for two and a half years. It started with a community of just 50 people mining the GFAM token, 
accumulating and stocking up. And when we came on board and brought the price up, what did they do? They sold and brought the price down to the point where it was either breaking even or we were actually losing money on our daily submissions and, and uh, claims. So the reason that happened is not because of a failure of the smart contract, but it was a miscalculation on how we were promoting it. And we were enticing leaders to come on board who had a large group of following and people by giving them 80% discount on our miners. And because of that, we skipped the process of why the smart contract is supposed to work in the first place. So we were never able to see how the design of the smart contract actually works. So Lynette decided, you know what? I want to prove this proof of concept. I want to prove that it can work. We're going to have a restart because, the, I mean, we're, we're in beta for the last couple of years on the Binance chain. We're going to have a restart and we're going to launch on the Avalanche chain from scratch. No special deals, no 80% off on miners, no giving miners. How many of you guys remember my will of fortune? I was giving away miners every presentation. Remember those days? <laughs> None of that. Everybody has to start from the beginning, even playing field, no special things for anybody, $50. And what ended up happening where I actually thought this was project was going to fail. I thought it had an 80% chance of failure. I was wrong. It has been a routing success. In fact, one of the most successful launches I have ever seen with this size of a community, without any hype in the market, without any any uh, grand tours around the country and AMAs and all this stuff that normal crypto projects have, this has been the most successful launch I've ever seen, where the token launched from $1 and went all the way to $125 in less than 60 days. I've never seen that. So I wanted to give you a little background for those of you who didn't know, and 90% of those of you in our community came on board after the avalanche launch. So you don't know the backstory on where we came from and why we're here and why we're so excited. Uh, so I'm gonna, this is gonna be a modified presentation. I'm gonna kind of skim through this since I wanted to give you guys that little background on what's going on. Let me ask you guys a question. How many of you made money yesterday? Type me in the chat box. If you made money yesterday, type me in the chat box. Why? Because this works. <laughs> Not just one person making money, everybody is. Now, the unintended consequence is this. You're going to get healthy. Some health facts. Heart disease and cancer are the top two causes of death in America. 67.5% of American adults are overweight or obese. 97% of Americans are failing to meet ideal healthy lifestyle that can protect your hearts. Tobacco use, poor nutrition, physical inactivity, and excessive alcohol use are top reasons for disease in America. The main problem is that most companies don't know how to motivate people to do what's right for their own health until it's too late. Here's what Get Fit Mining is doing to motivate you. Take a look. Tired of shelling out money for gym memberships you hardly ever use? Fed up with fad diets and quick fixes that never seem to deliver? We know the feeling, but what if there was a way to spend less and achieve more, much more, than you've ever dreamed possible? Get Fit Mining, the revolutionary platform that pays you to get fit. Imagine earning cold, hard crypto just for building those buns of steel or carving out that six pack. With Get Fit Mining, every step you take is not just towards a healthier you, but also towards financial freedom. Forget those hefty gym fees or that pantry stuffed with diet foods. Motivate yourself to be the best version of yourself and start building your retirement at the same time. What if what you mine today could change your tomorrow just doing what you are already doing but intensifying it? Picture this, the best fit version of yourself, traveling the world, driving that luxury car you've always dreamed of. All of this is possible with Get Fit Mining. Here's how it works. Strap on your favorite fitness tracker 
and start earning crypto for your everyday activities like walking, running, or cycling. The more you move, the more you earn. Our app syncs with your lifestyle. It tracks your progress and mines cryptocurrency while you exercise. It's like mining money while melting calories. Say hello to real-time rewards paid instantly. Achieve your fitness goals and watch your digital wallet grow. Connect with fellow fitness enthusiasts, challenge each other, and share your achievements. With each referral, boost your earnings and your fitness motivation. Join the movement that's reshaping what it means to be fit and financially savvy. Why put off feeling good and living well? The time is now, and Get Fit Mining is your gateway. Ready to make a move? Let's turn those fitness dreams into your financial reality. Jump on board and let Get Fit Mining guide you to a richer, healthier life. It's the future of fitness, and it's here now with Get Fit Mining. So why wait? It's time to turn those workouts into wealth. Download the Get Fit Mining app today and start your journey towards fitness and financial freedom. Remember, every step counts, every workout matters. With Get Fit Mining, you're not just getting fit, you're getting rewarded. It's fitness revolutionized. It's time to get fit, get rewarded, and start building your future one step at a time. See you on the healthier side of life. See you on the healthier side of life. I mean, there are there benefits to walking? This is Saturday morning. How many of you guys already been outside walking already? Whether you're Saturday morning walk, jog, or you're like Ken Francis riding your bike, Leonard Long already did his. What about walking your dog? What about doing your yard work? I mean, <laughs> uh, here's the real question. Are they out there doing that because they want the healthy benefits of walking and exercising? Or are they doing it because they're getting paid to? I mean, just 30 minutes every day can, can increase cardiovascular fitness, strengthen your bone, reduce body excess body fat and boost muscle power and endurance, reduce risk of heart disease, type 2 diabetes, osteoporosis, and some cancers. Physical activity may help to prevent or manage heart disease, stroke, and high blood pressure. Adults who sit less and do any amount of moderate to vigorous physical activity gain some health benefits and were motivated to do so because you're incentivized to do so by getting paid, turning your physical activity into an income stream. You want to know why I'm confident that this project will succeed? And I didn't say may succeed. I said will succeed. You know where my confidence comes in? Well, I understand people. If people make money in something, they do more of it because that's me. I'm a little bit slow sometimes when it comes to numbers. I never understand compensation plans or any of that stuff. When Lynette showed me the graph and her spreadsheet and all that, most of that went over my head. All I knew was that when I went out there and I moved and I submitted my activity, I got paid. So I just did more of it. So your physical activity is now an income stream. And this is not something we have to teach people how to do because you already have a phone. And your phone already has apps on your phone that is tracking your physical data. If you have an Android, you have Google Fit and Health Connect. Google Fit's being phased out, so it'll just be Health Connect on Androids. If you have an iPhone, it's Apple Health. So whether you like it or not, your phones are already tracking your information. You may not even know that because you probably never opened up the app, but it is still tracking all of your data, all of your information. Get Fit Mining is just an app that you download onto your phone at no cost, and it pulls the data from the apps already on your phone and turns it into a physical, physical hash or a digital hash through blockchain, and you're rewarded in a crypto token called MQT, a token that is already on the market. And I want to make one correction because I just did crypto talk this morning. I was talking about the difference with, with coins, tokens, altcoins, and meme coins because it's a meme coin rise that's about to happen. Get the, um, MQT is not in that category as a meme coin. It does have real world utility. It's only 21 million in circulation, not 1 trillion like most meme coins have out there that's based off of you know cartoon characters and whatnot. My initial saying of that is because it's gamified. We're gamifying this project. A lot of meme projects do the same thing. But this is a token unlike anybody has ever seen before. It doesn't operate in the same fashion or way. In fact, no token has ever operated the way this one has. It's in a league of its own. 
but it's going to reward you for your, your proof of physical activity. Most tokens have proof of physical work or proof of physical stake. We have proof of physical activity. And this isn't the only move to earn token or, or project on the market. You might have heard of step in or sweat coin. I've had these for years, as I stated earlier. Since 2022 with Sweatcoin, and I just paid this summer another, I think it was like $99 for another year subscription. Do you know how much money I actually made? You know how much money I actually made? <laughs> $20. I still don't even know how to pull it out. I shared it last week on, on, on when I was sharing the screen. $20. Like 3 million steps, two years. But maybe I can win a Tesla if I walk to the moon or projects like that. See, these apps are very limited in what they can do. Only GPS satellite outside. And you have to, uh, it doesn't work inside. Your GPS has to work. They're centralized entities, which is why I only made $20. And they have subscription fees. Gitfit Mining is decentralized. It's not a company. There are no restrictive feature sets. It works outside and inside. You don't even have to have your phone have a phone line on it as long as it connect to Wi-Fi. It gets you rewarded for your steps, your distance, your calories, your workouts, even your sleep. And are there benefits to sleeping? Yes. Getting seven to nine hours sleep a night keeps your heart healthy, reduces stress, and helps keep blood sugar consistent. It lowers your risk for serious health problems like diabetes and heart disease, reduces stress, improves your mood, and allows you to think more clearly. It helps to prevent inflammation and even control weight. I love to sleep, but now you're going to get paid to sleep. You're also going to get paid for your steps, your distance, your workouts, your calories, your sleep, all managed not by a company that takes all the profits, but by a smart contract that puts those profits back into the ecosystem. Now, there is are limits to what you actually can do. So you can have 20,000 max steps a day, 10 miles, two hours workout time, two to 4,000 calories burned, and max out eight hours of sleep. So, of course, you can do more than this, but you're only going to get credit up to those limits. Now, getting started with Gifted Mining, get back to the person who invited you. You're going to take your phone. You can have uh, fitness trackers that are optional, like I've got smartwatches that you can use. And I use that for convenience uh, so that I don't have to carry my phone with me everywhere that I go. And any, oh, oh, oh let me go back. And your phones already have the apps on it that's recording your data. Now, how Get Fit Mining takes that data and converts it into a token that you can get rewarded on is through something called mining. You remember Bitcoin? Bitcoin is not created out of thin air. Bitcoin is mined. That means it takes people who take their time, who purchase equipment, who program the equipment with software, who pay for the electricity to run it. And they're creating the Bitcoin blockchain. And every 10 minutes, the block is created. Bitcoin is rewarded out to all of the miners. And there's a competition for it. Whoever has the most mining power has the greatest chance of getting the most Bitcoin. And that's how it's been going since the beginning. Bitcoin has 20 million, 21 million coins ever in existence, only 19 million in circulation. Well, when you look at MQT, it's almost the same process. The difference is, instead of electricity powering our miners, your own physical activity is powering the miner. Now, there's 21 million in that will be in existence, but less than 300,000 in circulation. That's why the value of it went from $1 all the way up to $125 in less than 60 days. If you've been listening to Lynette this week, she's showed you a plan on how we're going to have the token worth more than $700 a coin over the next 60 days. Not based on hope, hype, or speculation, but based on math, based on numbers, based on the size of this community, the number of people using the product. The more people using the product, the higher the value of the token goes. And any activities getting it paid. 
from walking outside, inside, running, jogging, hiking, doing your yard work this Saturday morning, playing with your kids, playing with your grandkids, going to the grocery store. A lot of people, Saturday morning is grocery shopping day. You're walking up and down those aisles. That's steps. If you took a vacation, walking on the beach, going to sleep, any casual activity, doing your uh, Saturday for us is cleaning the house day, housework, any of that activity is rewarding you. Now, the reason why this project works, where many other projects in the past have failed, is because this has a self-sustaining ecosystem. This has something that Bitcoin doesn't. See, it took years for Bitcoin to reach $100 a coin. This did it in less than 60 days. Without the self-sustaining ecosystem, this project would have already been dead and gone in the first two weeks. It wouldn't have lasted. Why? Because most projects need seed fund money or they have a, a, a small community of people who purchase tokens at a discounted price. And then as soon as the token rises, they sell their tokens for a profit. They never even looked at it for being a long-term project. They just wanted a quick, quick money grab. And the project does a pump and dump. Or sometimes it was designed to do that on purpose. Or the project was never good to begin with, and it ends up getting shut down by the government. The owners pull a rug pull on everybody. We've been through all of that before. This project did not have any seed money raised. It was self-funded to the tune of almost $3 million. And it's got a self-sustaining ecosystem in the smart contract to provide the most important thing, which is something called liquidity. Why is that important? Well, if you want to sell your token, is there money there to sell it for? I know projects and I'm in some of them. In fact, I'm about to cancel uh, one of my, because I'm mining with more than 20 nodes. I'm about to cancel that because I know it's not going to go anywhere. And I'm paying $99 a month just to mine. But these projects, after years and literally thousands upon thousands of people have like $7,000 in the liquidity which makes no doggone sense. Why? Because those are centralized projects that are in business to make money for the company. So the company takes all the fees that it might have generated and they keep it. Whereas this smart contract takes those fees that have been generated and puts it right back into the ecosystem. And where are those fees generated? Well, every time you purchase the miner, you evolve and upgrade your miners, you submit your proof of physical activity, you claim your mining rewards, you unlock your mining dock slots, you create challenges and events, and you lease your miners. All of that is creating transaction fees because this is not going to a company on a company website. These transactions are taking place directly on the blockchain between your wallet and the blockchain. Hmm. And why do you think centralized exchanges like Gemini and Coinbase and Binance and FTX and, and, and L Bank and Kraken, the people behind those became multi-billionaires. Why? Because they took the profit. Whereas in a decentralized system, all of that money goes right back into the ecosystem. So even when there's a sell-off, the system kicks in and pulls the price right back up. How many of you guys saw what happened over the last two days? It was at 59, 60 cents. Now, last I looked, it was at 67 cents. 68, it reached 70 cents. I'm sorry. Dollars. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking the meme coins again. Dollars. <laughs> it went from 59, 60 dollars to $70, now it's like $67, $68. All-time highs at $125. People became well off, let's put it that way. Especially those that started when it was at a dollar. And they came up. This has changed people's lives. And it is open to everybody. People who have never made money before, they're making money here. And to get started... The right way, this is what we should have done when we came in on the Binance side, is you got to get a Lenny. The Lenny is $50. It gives you 50% mining power. You can have up to eight miners working for you. The more miners you have, the more rewards you're going to get. 
So you naturally want to have more mining power because like Bitcoin, there's a certain amount that's released every 10 minutes, every block. With MQT, there's 2,500 tokens released every single day to all of the miners. So the more all of us is competing for those 2,500 tokens. So if you have more mining power than somebody else, you're going to get more tokens. So how do you get more mining power? Well, you can evolve the Lenny to a primary, ultra, alpha, and the biggest is omega that has 300% mining power. So you can have eight omegas working for you right now. Let me let me let me do this. I know I know Ken had, had created some good recognition. Any of you guys have eight omegas and you are brave to share? Type me in the chat box if you got eight omegas running working for you right now. You're maximizing it out. Eight omegas. Now, how you upgrade is you evolve the Lenny to a primary, cost $50, a primary to an ultra, $40, ultra to alpha, $60, and it takes two alphas and $200 to get to the omega. You don't have to start that way. You can work your way up based on what your budget is. Total cost, if somebody said, Brandon, I want to maximize everything, I don't know, maybe $4,800, $4,900 or so, because we just... We just added the eighth minor. Now, is there proof? People say, yeah, Brendan, it's easy for you to say that people are making money. I don't believe it. Let me show you proof. Here is what Miss Casa just did last week when she actually claimed 10 days of her physical activity and where the money went. Take a look at this. Grand, beautiful risings, babies, and happy thriving Thursday. It's your girl, the Queen Connectress, and I am back because we are talking about Get Fit Mining. And for me, documentation beats conversation. So I am going to show you how easy it is for you to get paid off of your physical activity and your sleep. So the first thing I'm going to do is open up my MetaMask wallet and let you guys see that right now, I have 1.35 MQT in my MetaMask wallet. So then now I'm going to go to my Get Fit Mining app. And as you guys can see, every day, your steps, your miles, your calories, your workout, and your sleep, all that data is put into the Get Fit Mining app. The app turns that data into a hash and puts it on the blockchain. And that's how we're able to get paid for our physical activity and our sleep. Now, every day you have to get up and submit your data. When you submit your data, it shows up as a line of information right here on the bottom. Now, every day you can claim each line of information in order to be uh, rewarded your MQT. I like to wait for 10 days, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and claim my 10 days of data. I am going to submit that information. As you see, it says transaction in progress. And now my data has been claimed successfully. The MQT that I am rewarded from my physical activity and my sleep now shows up in my MetaMask wallet. So I'm going to go over there to MetaMask. Oops, let's do that again. There we go. And now you guys can see that I received 11 point seven, excuse me, 10.5, I think, MQT for the last 10 days. So like I said, you guys, you get paid instantly for your physical activity and your sleep. It all depends on when you want to claim your activity and when you decide to sell, how much you will actually make. All right, you guys have a wonderful day and you keep being healthy, active, and beautiful. I'll see you soon. Peace. Now, she just claimed about 10 MQT for the last 10 days. So that's like one MQT a day. Let's look at what that value is as of right now. At $66 a coin, that's $660 she made 10 days. Let's say it stays that way times three. That's almost $2,000 a month, Two thousand, almost $2,000 a month.
at this price, if she sold it at this price, what happens? Those same tin when it was at its all time high of one hundred and twenty five dollars. That's twelve hundred and fifty times three. That's three thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars on a monthly basis. The average person is earning around seventy so dollars a day right now with this project. So it's real. It's real. Coming soon, your ability to lease miners. You'll be able to, because the minor value is going to go up. If I were you, I would, yeah, yeah. We know you're not maximized. I told you, I saw your, you didn't even do two hours workout time. <laughs> Less than an hour. <laughs> but she's not even maximizing it. Doing that. We've got people making a couple of hundred dollars a day right now. Some people are working this casually. Others are working it like it's a job full-time income. But Ms. Casa is on the point right now, she's a five-figure a month earner in her household. Five figures a month from your own physical activity. But when the prices of the miners go up, it might become out of reach for the average person when they get started. They can still participate because they can lease miners from us. My grandpa always said, have multiple properties, live in one and lease out the others. So what if you did lease them out? That person will still be able to submit their proof of physical activity. They'll be able to claim their mining rewards. But guess what? You get paid <laughs> because they're leasing it from you. So get started today and get started by getting back to the person who invited you. If you say, even after all that, you say, nah, Brandon, is not for me. I don't understand why you would say that but it's your prerogative to say no. At least thank you for being taking time out of your schedule on this Saturday morning to at least hear and see what this is about. Just know that when you leave here and any physical activity you do, and I guarantee you will because you sleep and you walk, you just choose not to get paid for it. And that's your prerogative. Everybody else that decides that you want to move forward if you're a guest. I have to let you know now, there is a learning curve. You are If you've never been involved in crypto before, you've never purchased crypto, and you don't know what a wallet is, you don't know what blockchains are, what's the difference between Ethereum and Avalanche, and how do I set that up? Then you take make, make a decision that you will take the time, whether it takes an hour to two hours, to learn how to get yourself onboarded. I had one person tell me, this was back, I think the price was at like $95 a coin. I showed this individual, I made $350 that day, in one day. He was jacked out of his mind, wanted to, yeah, sign me up, send me the link. So I sent him some instructions, wait a minute, I have to watch an hour long video? Man, I ain't got time for that. I said, really? You don't have time to watch an hour long video that can show you how to get set up that could potentially earn you $300 a day? You deserve to be on your nine to five job and remain broke. You have the wrong mindset. So be willing to learn something new. This is new technology. ACJ, hey, don't, don't, don't give out, don't give out the secret here. <laughs> but this is new technology. Just like when 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 VCRs came out for the first time, my parents could never program the, the, the freaking uh, clock on it. When emails came out, Al Roker, David Letterman made fun of Bill Gates about the internet and email. But the world is using it now. I learned something back in 2017 that blockchain technology is going to disrupt every single industry on the planet today. Whether you like it or not, believe it or not, trust it or not, your opinion of it is irrelevant. You won't be able to have a job in the future unless you have this skill set. So you better start learning now. And why not make money while you're learning? See, the one thing I love about this project is you're going to learn <laughs> that you would have never learned before. And you're going to be more strong forward on the other side. So be willing to learn something new. And then let's, and then let's go to work. As a disclaimer, I'm not a licensed financial or health advisor to be giving financial advice. I share information for entertainment, training, and education purposes only. It is up to you 
uh, to take your own informed, intelligent decision on which direction you want to move into. There's no guarantee of exactly how much money, because people want to say, how much money can I make? I can't answer that. There's three reasons that determine what you will earn, not make, but earn. Number one, I don't know what your level of physical activity is. I don't know if you're going to be on the couch today watching college football or if you're going to be on your bike like Kenneth Francis out there making money. I don't know. Number two, I don't know what level of mining power you're going to have working for you. Are you going to start off with one Lenny just to see how it works? Are you going to get 10, I mean, seven omegas, eight omegas, uh, ultras, alphas, a mixture of them? I don't know. We all start off with Lenny's. So I don't know how long it will take for you to up, evolve and, and go up. And then I don't know when you decide you're going to sell your token. Okay. I don't know that. See, when we first got started, people were scared. They didn't know if this was going to last long. So when the value went up to $4.40, then $4.90, and then people started to sell and the price came down to about $2.30. Oh, that was a bubble. That was a shaky time. People didn't know what was, is this thing going to make it? Is it going to last? Well, I'm in profit. I better sell my tokens now while I can before it goes to zero. And people sold hundreds, literally hundreds, if not some. I saw a person, a thousand, fifteen hundred MQT tokens at two dollars and thirty cents. Let me, let me, I'm, I'm gonna dream mode this out a little bit. Someone sold, I remember seeing this, someone sold fifteen hundred MQT at two dollars and thirty cents. They got three thousand four hundred and fifty bucks. Well, not bad, especially when it only lost at a dollar. They're in profit, right? But that same 1,500 tokens today, had they held for 60 days? is now worth $99,000. What happens if Lynette's numbers come to fruition in the next 60 to 90 days? Those same 1,500 tokens, the price goes to $779 a coin. That's 1.1 million. Let me go back again. That person sold 1,500 MQT for $3,000 60 days ago that in the next 60 days could potentially be worth 1.1 million. We've seen this before. There was a time when Bitcoin reached $100 for the very first time. Bitcoin uh, someone sold 189 Bitcoin for $111 a piece. They made 20K off of that. But a uh, same 189 Bitcoin today at 56,000, I'm sorry, 60. Wait, what is, what is the price of Bitcoin right now? I think, hold on. I, mean, I just did crypto talk and I was looking at it. Let's see here. 65,000, yeah. At $65,000 a coin, that's $12.2 million. Now, selling to evolve, nothing wrong with that. I did. Because you are evolving to have an asset that's producing you more MQT instead of selling to take a little profit. Now, if you need to sell for a small profit, that's okay as well. That's the point. I get excited when I see the red chart. When I see people selling, not scared that it's going to go to zero, but I see people selling because now they can buy food. Now they can put gas in their car. Now they can pay that electricity bill that was high from this summer. They can pay for their kid to go to, to homecoming. They can pay off some of their debt. They can start to breathe a little bit, pay their rent and their mortgages. That is what this is all about. And some of you guys are in a position to become millionaires with this. That's where we're at. Now, coming soon, we are now, we'll be moving from the brand of Get Fit Mining to Move Quest. In the next 30 to 45 days or so, the beta of the, uh, move, the new Move Quest app is, is starting, I guess, this weekend. So you're going to see a whole new look to what the future of this is going to be.
We're planning an event in Vegas. Hopefully we'll have the exact date set this coming week. It will be at the Mandalay Bay around the, looking at the second week of November. I will definitely be there. So who's going to be there? Who wants to come and hang out with us? We're going to have some fun in Vegas. So that's going to happen. That will be our first big event in November. And the next presentation that's taking place, we have, uh, oh, for those of you as well, especially that need your handheld, we've got support in place, Facebook groups, Telegram groups, WhatsApp groups. We even have a customer support Zoom that's open five days a week. I was on there yesterday. They were shocked when my name popped up when I was in there. They're like, Brandon, what are you here for? I was like, well, you guys did it. You just did an update and my phone wasn't tracking my sleep. I got it fixed today. I, uh, you know, I, I I just took the easy way out and I for my iPhone, I downloaded an app called Auto Sleep. It cost five dollars one time. There are free apps out there. Some of you are using Sleepmeister. I was even on with Q and with customer support, and we couldn't figure out why the Sleepmaster was not connecting to two of my iPhones. But the fact that they were there, I was pulling my hair out, well, I don't any, my non-existent hair out all week because my son updated his iPhone first. I didn't update mine. And his sleep wasn't tracking and we couldn't get the thing to work. So I said, let me hop on here. They couldn't figure it out either. So I said, so they, there was a, they said you can use, well, Ali was talking about Pillow is a good app that he uses. But I, I, I went to the, the Telegram group on MoveQuest. There's a tab that says app, Android users, app, uh, Apple users. I looked at the Apple user group, and one of the members said, hey, auto, auto sleep works for me. I said, oh, really? So I downloaded auto sleep, and it worked this morning. No problem. So I'm going to do that on my, on my iPhones. Yeah, I'll pay the $5. That's a cost of doing business for me. That's nothing. So I got that to work. So we have that in place and we do this presentation in this way, Monday through Friday at 1 p.m. Eastern, 9 a.m., uh, 10, 10 a.m. Pacific, Monday through Friday. And I'm looking for more presenters, people who want to present. You see Miss Marnita Casa present yesterday. So we're looking for more presenters. Following that, Monday through Thursday, twice a day at 2 p.m. Eastern and 9 p.m. Eastern, you got Kenneth Francis and Herschel Crow. twice a day. And they go into deep detail. They now pull up the hood and see what how the engine's running. They're also taking your questions and answers and walking you through what issues you may have. Everybody has different phones. You have different level of knowledge of crypto. You have different personal devices you're using. So there is no one way fits them all. So, of course, some people kind of need a little bit of help. And even if you don't, I encourage you to be there on the training because I guarantee you're going to learn. I don't miss any of them. I don't have to be there. I don't. These guys are phenomenal. Herschel, Ken, and Q, and, and Brian Rose, and Michael, they're in my downline. I don't have to be there. But I'm there to support and I'm there to learn because I might run into a problem with somebody else that I didn't know about and I see it there. So I strongly encourage you to take the time to learn. There's nothing else out there that's going to make you this type of money in this fashion right now. I mean, I, people keep coming up to me with other opportunities. And I'm like, get out of my face with that right now. You know, they, and the, unless you're making more money than me, which... 99% of you of them are not. I don't want to hear it. Everybody is making money over here. Type me in the chat box if you made money today or yesterday. That's the bottom line. Why am I looking at something else? So here's what's happening next. Tonight, I have not done an evening call in a while. I'm going to be doing a live reading of the Move Quest ecosystem. Lynette showed it off earlier this, this past week. I don't know if it was Monday or Wednesday night, but I'm going to do a live reading of that tonight at uh, 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific on this same Zoom, and I will stream it on Facebook. 
So you guys can share to your own Facebook groups, share to your own, if people want to know, you know, how, what, what's, what's the background of this? How does the thing work? Then uh, you want to make sure you, you plug into that. It'll be the same Zoom link. On Monday, I think it's going to be Monday night. I'm not sure, but Lynette will be covering what she covered Thursday night as well. I, and probably we'll have some updates on Monday night. So you'll hear from Lynette again Monday. Uh, I do, uh, I didn't want to do Q&A, but Leonard's got his hand up. I want to recognize him. So Leonard, go right ahead. We would like to share. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before you do that, before you do that, uh, let me show this video and then we'll do that. Take a look at this. <laughs> yeah, my son just woke up or just came in here and told me that his the iPhone sleep is not working. So yeah, so anybody that's having any issues, uh, there's many different options out there. But what's worked for me was uh, I went and got that auto sleep. And that's worked fine. No issues with that. All right, go ahead, Leonard. Good day, everyone. You know, first of all, I would tell you, I have not had any problems myself. I have an iPhone. I've not had any problems with sleep. And I have multiple devices. So one thing I would tell everybody is, is if you do have a problem, don't stress over it. You know, there's always going to be somebody that's going to be able to help you. The other thing I was going to say is, Brandon, when you said someone had sold 1,500 tokens, I believe that was me. And if you remember in the very beginning, when we were starting to go into this new Avalanche side, I called you and asked you about, hey, I have some concerns. Wasn't sure if this was going to to uh, really take off because I saw we weren't using the ecosystem in the original side, and I, I saw that as being a big problem. And you told me, well, I think there's an 80% chance of failure. And I happened to see something in the very, very beginning that uh, just gave me this feeling that you need to not pass this up and you need to get involved. So I got a... I got more involved. That selling of 1,500 tokens was to create a second account. I have two accounts. They're fully funding each. They're, they're funding themselves. I don't put any money into the system, and I'm making somewhere around two to three tokens a day. Hmm. Two to three tokens a day. I have my, my beloved wife, she just thinks I'm crazy. I've tried to get her involved. She actually has an account. She puts no effort into it. And all and anytime I would have a discussion with her about this, she would say, show me the money. Well, at the end of August was her birthday. And in order to prove that there's value in this, we went down to the local LV store and she got a new purse. And I have now paid half of that bill off twenty nine hundred dollars went to my apple card i'm telling you guys there is value in this how much value is really going to depend on what miners you have how much you work out and when i mean work out how much you move i literally ride my bike to get my miles in and i go to the gym and i walk on the treadmill and i recently had knee surgery so that's why i I do very little and I'm earning a lot. Those that put more effort into it are going to see big rewards. And I've heard these conversations with Lynette over and over. I've seen math numbers. I, I can't even tell you how high this is gonna go. All I know is based off of pure math, this, this is going to surpass Bitcoin at some point in time. It's not going to take very many people. Right now, I think we only have about 5,000 people involved in the system. Those that get in it now 
are going to see the benefits. If you can hold your tokens, I would suggest you hold them. But if you have to sell them, sell them. We've already heard about people saving their homes, saving their cars. Their health has changed. One lady has some neurological problems and is in another country. And she's talking about her company dropping her health benefits. And because of this, she has the opportunity to make money to pay for those health benefits. This, this is going to change people's lives. So anybody who's listening to this that's not involved, I highly suggest you, you seriously take a look at it. It's going to take a learning curve and it, it will change your life for the better, I believe. At least that's what I believe. All right. It's really, oh, go ahead, Leonard. That's really all I have to say. And if anybody really wants to know, this, this always seems to pop up. If you notice, we have our miners. They're Lenny's, Primaries, Ultras, Alphas, and Omegas. In the original system, we only had four miners. People were complaining about the cost of miners. A, a fifth miner was introduced named Bob that was to be given out for free. It only made 20% and you could only get one of those. So, you know, that's where that it, it started. And then... Lynette, she created a third or a sixth miner called Bob Two. In, in that was a little confusing because you'd have Bob One and Bob Two, which one does what? You know, I just made the suggestion to her to call it Lenny. And and sometimes people ask, well, why do we have this strange miner called Lenny when all the other ones are way different? Well, that is because of me just making a suggestion, hey, call it Lenny. As a joke, um, that's what I suggested to Lynette, not knowing the next morning, bright and early, at like five o'clock my time in the morning, I was getting a message from her saying, hey, we have a new miner. We're not going to call him Bob, too. We're actually going to call him Len Lenny. And that's the miner that you see. That was because of me and, and, and my nonsense of just of, uh, suggesting the name. But the name actually comes because when I was a child, my name was Lenny and my dad, I'm a junior. And because there would be confusion between us, that's how I got the name Lenny. And so that's why I had suggested it to her. And so that's the story of Lenny, if anybody, you know, it, it seems like every once in a while, someone's going to ask about that, but that's where the name Lenny comes from. So that, that's, 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 a, that's a cool story <laughs> for those of you. Who just, know. <laughs> yeah. So, but that's just my part of it. Other than that, I'm 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 not a part of the system. Other than I'm I participate in the system, and I really implore all of you guys that are not involved to seriously take a look at it. Look at it because it doesn't take very much to get involved. And once you're involved, you can move your way up. And I promise you, this is this is going to change people's lives. I know this system's going to run to at least 2087. That's a long time frame. I'm not going to be here, but my grandkids will have all these miners to to use as they see fit. All right. Thank you for sharing, Leonard. And I'm glad to see his success because I know his story and there's several projects that he was a part of with his mother as well that were promising, but didn't work out. Now, this one is making it happen. So thank you for sharing, Leonard. All right. There is another person I do want to bring up is uh, Kenneth Francis to share uh, some some updates and some information in his story. So go ahead, Ken. Brandon, phenomenal job. Great story, Leonard. And uh, yeah, at this point, I mean, there's nothing I have to say, <laughs> to be honest with you. This is probably, again, one of the better presentations I've heard from uh, A to Z. I mean, I did a 10-mile ride and enjoyed every second of it. <laughs> so I got my 10 miles in. And if you even saw me, I was getting those steps in too. That's a little hint and a clue. Take you back to the BMX days, can I ride with no hands? You know, try me. <laughs> and here I was. So, uh, yeah, you get the steps, you get the cycle, you know, you get the heart rate, you get the you get the uh, the distance in as well on a bike ride. But anyway, uh, yeah, man, this thing is, uh, uh, you know, every time I talk about it, I get kind of, I don't know what other adjectives or verbs or whatever I could to explain it, but it's really unprecedented what we're doing. And uh, you can tell 
by the sheer numbers of people and the impact, you know, because of that. I mean, we're looking at it's 5,000 people in my neighborhood, Brandon. Uh, it's 5,000 people. I was just riding this time, just riding around the neighborhood. There's 5,000 homes where I am. They're all on like two and a half acres or so, you know, and it's just, that's nothing. That's not a lot of people. That's not a lot of, we've done, we've literally scratched the scratch of the scratch of the scratch of the scratch. And you already see the average income of these, of everybody involved at $80 a, a day. And, you know, a lot of people, I would say, how many, Brandon, what do you think? Maybe 30% of us really believe. Mm -hmm. I don't know, even if, even if it's that number, you know, there's a lot of sales, a lot of, a lot of that, you know, good pressure that's going on right now, the buying and the selling and the ups and downs, the ebb and flows of the market. But it's just, you just got to have a little vision here, you know, let go of a little bit of lack of knowledge. Let go of that. Forget about what you don't know, right? Let go of that and start to leverage the information. Because what Lenny Leonard, what Lenny Leonard just shared, what Brandon just shared, you know, you think about those Bitcoin miners way back in the day. Brandon, what was the, the average income you think of a Bitcoin miner back in 2012 or 2013? Oh, that was hundreds of dollars at that time. A day? To what, to today. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What I'm saying, though, I'm saying that's where we're at, though. You know, you think about what Lynette's built and her vision and what she's put together here. Put yourself in position of being one of the first individuals to mine Bitcoin and approve transactions. Uh, that's the opportunity here. You know, it just trying to put a different light on it because we get lost in the sauce with all the distractions and the manipulation and the, the mind games the world plays on you. You know, just focus on the math here. <laughs> just focus on the numbers. And the numbers are the numbers. One plus one is two. Every time. There's no disputing it. So the numbers that you heard about or the numbers of, you know, that for us that have been involved, those numbers are real. How do we get there? Just what I was doing earlier, becoming a product of the product or being the product, right? Plugging into the system, plugging into the webinars, listening to what Brandon's saying, just being touch, tapping someone on the shoulder and say, hey, you got to listen to this. The numbers are the numbers, folks. We're going to reach 5,000. We already have. We're going to reach 10,000. We will. By the time we're probably in Vegas, and uh, it's absolutely the best success I've had in my career in network. Period. Since two thousand, full time two thousand eight, full time in crypto since two thousand and uh, two thousand and twenty, full time. Uh, when I got laid off and went back into crypto, I've been in crypto since fifteen sixteen. I've never had this kind of success, and we haven't even, we haven't even done it in ninety. We haven't even been here ninety days. So, I'm a believer. Uh, I'm a doer. I'm out here getting my, my time in, getting my, my miles in, getting my sweat on, uh, and just being an example that it can be done. And folks, there's no excuse. We have people that are literally bedridden, maxing out. We, I have a screenshot, I should show it, but I'll put it in the, tele, in the telegram. There's an individual that is bedridden and she has over 20,000 steps in the red category, the high intensity category of her 22,000 steps. She has 20,000 plus steps in the red category. So what's your excuse? She can't even walk. Mm. I'm just saying, she's making it happen regardless of her circumstances. So I don't wanna hear about when are we putting more miners? When are we putting more tokens in the market? When are, we, when are you maxing out at eight omegas? I'm done, Brandon, appreciate it, man. I'll see you on the next one. This is yes, incredible. Sir. I'm yeah, excited. These early days, I mean, Bitcoin in those early days, you can mine Bitcoin with a laptop computer. Today, <laughs> you need a factory and you need an army of people. It's, it's, it's out of the price range for most people. Right now, you can start with $50 with us. Uh, yes, Mr. Kenny Taylor, go right ahead. Thank you, sir. Good morning, everyone. Uh, I'm, I'm going to keep it short, but. Just real quick, I, I, I want everyone to start changing our vocabulary from this is going to change people's lives to this is changing people's lives today. It has been changing people's lives since we started. Me personally, I was one of those early soul to evolve up for me and, and my family. That's over $300,000 today. I sold at $4. But to evolve up, 
And now I'm in a position to pay off my bills. The only reason I'm not paying them now because I want to help the community let the price go up. But at the end of the year, I'll be paying off my car, my credit cards. Next year, I'm planning to pay off my condo and start looking for a house. This is something that's going to allow you to live the life that you want to live, not the life that you're forced to live due to circumstances. This is inheritance for your children, your grandchildren. It's, it's a no brainer. We have to get people into this and help people get out of their own minds and see the value and see what the future can be because we're living it now. Every, like you say from everyone's circumstance is different from whatever it is, you know, health, uh, finances, but people are changing their lives. They're paying off bills. They're, they're buying, you know, healthcare. They're pay, doing whatever they need to do every day. And if you can't hold, you sell it to enhance your life, that's great. If you can hold, that's great. But because, like Brandon said, you have the cow and not just the, the milk, it's going to continue. <laughs> you're going to continue earning. You're going to continue enhancing your life. Now, I don't know about Leonard, but I'm planning to be here in 2090. I'll be 120. <laughs> get Fit's going to get me there. Move Quest is going to get me there. <laughs> I'm working on it. <laughs> But that's all I had to say. Everyone have a blessed day. Be safe. All right. Thank you, Mr. Taylor. All right, everybody. That is it for today. I will be back tonight, 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific. We're going to read live together the Move Quest ecosystem. Uh, it's 32 pager. And we're going to have fun with that. The next presentation will be on Monday morning at 1 p.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Pacific. And then training with Herschel at 2 p.m. and 9 p.m. Eastern on Join the Movementum. And Lynette will be on Monday as well uh, to share some updated information. With that, enjoy the rest of your weekend. Get your steps in. Maximize your activity. Upgrade your miners. That's another thing, too. The goal is if you don't have omegas, upgrade to omegas because that is what's helping the ecosystem. No, Lynette won't be until Monday. So Monday. With that, take care, everybody. All right, then I'll be out. Bye-bye.